hollering. I'm sitting there over there talking to Prince like Prince. She got security because niggas been trying to holler. That's what I was going to say. Are they hollering and you just not No, you just not checking? Prince standing there with the face like, nigga, I dare you open your mouth. No, I have security because people have not only... First of all, I have security because I'm not fucking just anybody. Let's start there, okay? I've been doing this for a long time. That Stop part, playing. Part, Second yeah. of all, I've had people not only not only threaten my son's life, but also my life because they think I'm getting $200,000 in child support and I duped a fucking 16-year-old child, <laughs> okay? So, yeah, I'm not going to just walk around just me. It's just me and him. It's just me and Prince. So, you guys are saying I would love to just have a list of guys and you know what probably pre-book nothing but a nike store in my dms checks everywhere now because i wrote a book i have literally have had grown men write me will not say their name be like i'm afraid of you and you know what you fucking should be because i'm not i don't just suck a dick and shut up so like yeah i have substance yeah i open my mouth yes i'm in a leadership role like that you're talking about the, the 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 leader of the hussies or whatever it's like no i'm just a leader of truth like this is like my reality like i'm not here to make it sound good you're like oh, you haven't really had any growth you know you did the same thing oh my god well no, guess what you no no but listen then guess what how like what kind of advice could i give if i had a perfect life honestly now i'm a fucking baby mama and i can relate to a whole group of different bitches now because child support alimony baby daddy drama being tied to someone forever much different than what's been uh, what's been painted out there so a, a man, love, I, man and I was and I would sit here and say that a man is not a financial plan. That's why I've been independent all these years. That's why I feel so crippled just even having a child with somebody no, because a man you, is definitely you can't a plan. just go, no. No, a man is definitely a financial plan. Okay. It's happening out here a lot like every day. And being, <laughs> I'm saying and being that, planned daily. No, and but I'm planned. saying I would I, like I don't even like men enough to be dependent on one. And that's been my attitude. Up really until like I decided, oh, I'm going to try to give, I'm going to give love a chance. I'm going to try. Here I am. I'm completely at your mercy living with you when I just gave up my apartment. I got rid of all my furniture in California and I even ended up selling my car because you promised to get me one that I, that you never did. That's my favorite bag to promise to call. Oh God. And it's just, we fall for it every time. <laughs> no, I should have just kept all, Yo, but, just look around at the line, whatever. But, I, I mean, <laughs> but that's what I'm saying. Girl, so it's got like. cars over here, girl. But that's what I'm saying. So like, yeah, i I fell for the okie doke, and I don't have to sit here and you lie. Have been, you, you know what? Maybe we've been looking at this wrong. Maybe you were a victim. It's not about being a victim. I'm, I, at the end of the day, I still chose to enter this relationship. I chose to roll the dice. I chose to have a baby before marriage, and, and I don't even think marriage really would have changed anything. But I accept what comes behind it. I'm not looking to be some fucking victim. I look. You think I'm some villain? I'd, I'll be whatever you want me to be. You should be done. I don't for, care. You, oh, you should be. Can done. I ask you a question? Oh. 